usually it's just Carly yapping anyway, so. Workout was much harder than, than I had originally described. We're gonna be there on day 100 together. to reaching their arms out, pulling through their bodies. We're just trying to teach them how to maximize each stroke. So for someone like James or all the, any of the other swimmers, especially when you do distance events, when you're, whether it's open water swimming, Ironman triathlons, learning how to maximize each stroke and use as few strokes as possible while going as fast as possible is obviously going to be the biggest help and the biggest aid to them when they have to do a bike or a run right afterwards. Try and go as fast as they can in the swim, while also saving as much energy as they possibly can um, for their other events. Okay, we're gonna move on to our main set. Three 500s. Okay, three 500s. First one, we will break up into hundreds. So the first 500 will be broken up into hundreds. 10 seconds rest in between. Then the second one will break up 200, 100, 200. 15 seconds rest in between. The last one, we'll come in, we'll rest for about a minute, then we'll eat that one, we'll see race pace for as fast as possible. all the time but I'm having to add in a couple workouts that I would do on different days because I'm headed to Tennessee with Sunny Joe and we are doing a speaking event there um, live speaking events are back on board so that's a lot of fun uh, my last event that I'll be doing until after the hundred I'm gonna start speaking again probably around 
August 15th. So did the swim earlier this morning and then right now I'm doing a two hour run. Um, it's my longer run. So it's gonna be a lot of just specificity, lower volume zone one. And then I'm gonna add in every mile, I'm gonna do a quarter mile sprint. So basically breaking the workout in after the warm up, the middle section will just be three quarters miles easy, quarter mile a little bit harder. And we're talking maybe a 70.3 half Ironman type pace, half marathon type pace, um, nothing crazy. Wake up the body, get it going, and then we'll hit another meal. And then this afternoon we've got a bike ride. Today's a big endurance kind of day. Um, and I've only stacked it that way because I'm going out of town. I'll be gone the next three days. So good, just hit two hours on the run. Super effective, felt great. And I misspoke earlier. I had it flip-flopped. It was actually three quarters of a mile at race pace and then only a quarter off instead of three quarters off and a quarter um, at race pace. So workout was much harder than, than I had originally described, but it's good. Uh, it takes a team to accomplish anything great. So. Look at that brisket, broccoli, sweet potato. Surprising amount too that comes out of this little package. And that's a plate full of food. That's gonna fill up an Iron Man right there. Finished with the podcast, did a tech check, had a call with the sponsor, and now I'm doing my bike ride. We're in the last 36 minutes, and I call these ramp ups inversion ramps, meaning we slowly build the power, a little tiny break, start where you left off and build back down. So it's kind of like a, a pyramid with a small break in the middle. These are eight minutes long. So two basically 20 minute sets with a two minute recovery in between. And it's kind of that Ironman race pace. I'd actually call this half Ironman race pace with some, with some breaks. So not like zone four, definitely zone three. Low zone three work. After this is done, I'm gonna have another meal. 34 minutes left of work today on here. It's been a, a big day. We're gonna put in close to seven hours. Obviously, Aaron's doing work. Aaron's always doing work. Getting nice and strong. He's the wingman, but I call him the protector. And it's for a dang good reason. And uh, he's gonna be out there, he's doing the work. You wanna do anything big, you gotta do the work. He gets that. I respect that from him. And uh, I have no doubt we're gonna be there on day 100 together. And that's gonna, that is gonna be a special moment. And uh, yeah, keep turning the pedal, baby. What's up everybody? Thank you so much for watching today's episode. If you liked what you saw, like, comment below. Tell us what you wanna see in the future. We're making these videos for you. So go ahead, subscribe, share, tell all your friends, and enjoy the next video.